And this is that matchup that Reglot talked about earlier on. Ricky Banderas taking on Ray Gonzalez. You saw Ray trying to bring that chair in. Ray, Ricky Banderas gets the drop kick to the chair, and Ray goes down, and now Ricky's got that chair. Going to the crowd for approval if he swings, if he hits this race done. Yeah, that, uh, wait a second. Uh, he's not going to get a chance. Members of the Millennium family are this now coming one. out. Thunder, Lightning, Hangman, Hughes, Chet well, the Jet, new well, member. Well, this one over before it started here, Bowie. We thought we were finally going to get to see Ray Gonzalez and Ricky Bandettis, but within moments, it's, it's destroyed. The Millennium family with new member Chet the Jet in there just picking apart Bandettas. And I'll tell you what, we talk about Ricky Bandettas having some kind of, I don't know, supernatural powers. But, hey, he's in there with six, seven, maybe even more guys all by himself. I don't know what he can do here. Look at a pop. Dave. The Lion is here to back up uh, Ricky Bandettas. Hangman trying to take control of him there. Oh, what a thunderous clothesline from Apollo. Thunder over to try to take his shots. Thunder and Lightning together here, teaming up on the young Lion. Oh. Breaking right through and bringing his own. This man is so powerful, boy. The guy is powerful right now, breaking through that clothesline here. But now Ray Gonzalez and a super kiss. Ray Gonzalez still on his feet and he's in trouble. He's in big trouble right now. And the person who's in trouble right now is Apollo because here comes Victor with that bat. Well, Victor, the bodyguard, the equalizer. Stepping in to save Ray Gonzalez, his newfound partner, family member. That is, oh, goodness. Jeremy, right across the head, I got to tell you. That's that, a concussion. That is a concussion, boy. I don't care who you are. Easy, easy. And look at other members of the family guarding the entrance to make sure no one else comes out to help. Vandettas and Apollo are being picked apart here. This acquisition of Victor the bodyguard and Chet the Jet right now paying dividends in that ring those dividends right now are paying as uh, ricky banderas and apollo are getting worked over in the ring very interesting strategy here employed very smart move oh, get using that chair to choke banderas well regular out they let him through because of course he's not going to be of any physical help that is true Oh, look at that shot to the rib. Bandettas continuing to be picked apart. He's going after the knee now. Fans right here very upset at what's going on. Now, wait a second. Trash on the ring here. He's going to stop oh. on that ankle now, Jeremy. Ray Gonzalez. <laughs> well, Regal trying to grab control here. Yo. Reglar telling them to stop right now. Reglar, not where he wants to be here. You don't want to get in a physical confrontation with Ray Gonzalez here. He doesn't want Ray's disrespect to the company to continue here. Well, forget the company, forget disrespect. He's in physical danger here. That's right, even Chaparro's in there getting a piece. Wait a minute. Wait, wait. Shane, that's Shane's music. That is Shane's music, and here they go, they're gonna Jeremy. They're going to bust through the line here. Brawling at the entrance of the IWA arena. Miguel, Miguel Pettis Pettis has broke the line. The ring, Miguel running Victor off. They had that entrance guarded, but those four men right there just finally blew their way through to make a big save here in the ring, allowing Reglado to be saved. Reglado is getting into it again physically with Ray Gonzalez. You may or may not like Reglado, but that's not a smart move. Well, yeah, he's, once again, he's talking about how he's Mr. Ratings and reminding us who he is. Yeah. Well, I don't know about that. He's claiming the fans are sitting here. They, they pay to come see him. Well, absolutely. He's Mr. Ratings. He's the champion of the IWA. He's the very reason these people are sitting in this arena right now. Well, I don't know the very reason. I'm sure he has a fan or two. Oh, it's the his very mom reason. and dad. But uh, right now his claim is ridiculous. Casey Chicano. 
Van a pagar las malditas consecuencias de tu estúpida actitud. Y Ricky, el comienzo, pero nunca más vas a poner tus asquerosas manos encima del mejor luchador libra por libra en Puerto Rico. Mr. Rating, Rey Gonzalez. That's right, well, well, claiming that Ricky Banderas will never put his hands in them again, that they're all going to pay for their dumb choices, but Reglar calling him the stupid one. And there you go, Reglar making another match. He says we're going to get the Ricky Banderas Rey Gonzalez match again later on. Yeah, and saying that if he doesn't face him, Jeremy, he's going to lose his job and $5,000. And putting a match right now up against the, the tag champs. Need to face. Well, he's got it. He just made a tag team title match. Shane and Casey James taking on Thunder and Lightning. Talk about playing matchmaker here this week. That's right. It's looking like. Victor. There's another one. Victor the bodyguard taking on Apollo. Apollo. Well, there's your card for the night. Reglan has stepped in and given us a complete rundown. He says Ray has his team. There's a lot of guys. He has his team. Wait a second, but one guy's missing. And that one guy that's a part of his team that's not here in this arena right now is Savio Vega, Jeremy says. Well, Reglada continues to claim that he's got Savio Vega. And here you see later on the reaction that Ray and his family had to that announcement. We got matches made for in the future. We've got Victor and Apollo. We have a tag team title match, Thunder and Lightning versus Shane and Casey. And we will get Ray Gonzalez versus Ricky Bonderas again. All matches that we'll see in future in the future here in the IWA. And the family's not happy. They certainly aren't right now. All of these guys have some pretty tough matchups. Victor, confident in his battle up against uh, Apollo and confident in his family. Well, they're basically just kind of talking themselves up, trying to get themselves ready to go. $5,000 fine that Reglano laid down with any kind of interference in those matches that he set up. Trying to level the playing field here. That's all Reglano's trying to do. It is. Oh, goodness. Será tu cementerio, guste al que no le guste. Well, but I guess yeah, he's, he's going to be in his cemetery whether he likes it or not, Jeremy. Unbelievable. Ricky Bandanas with evil intentions. And we go Chaparro and Mini Savio, I suppose we could call him, back in Reglar's office. Oh, look, they're, they're trying to help him clean up. They're shredding unused documents. And, well, that seems to be a very charitable most move. Uh, gesture here by Chapato. It's certainly nothing like that. I'm trying to get rid of papers, make sure Savio doesn't have any way to get back in the IWA because as his secretary just said, Reglada is out looking for Savio. Well, I just can't believe that Reglada would even have the ability to get Savio Vega back in the IWA. To this point, Chapato has not been able to do it. Ray did not, was not able to do it. Nobody's been able to do it. I don't see why Reglada would be the one to get to do it. it, it well, it's, right now, Chapato apparently on the phone with Ray Gonzalez. Pretty concerned about all the stipulations and matches that were just made by Tomas Reglada. Well, Chapato telling him not to worry that uh, everything's going to be all right, but I don't know about that. Especially knowing that Reglar is out there somewhere. I think Savio's real close, and I think Reglar is close to finding him. Uh, you're just believing what Reglar said. We have nothing to go on other than Reglar's word. His word holds no meaning to me. Apparently, Ray, Ray telling Chapato that he has an idea. Chapato, I guess, just trusting it as Mini Savio continues to shred documents. We're going to have to figure this one out, boy. We, we definitely will. Ladies and gentlemen, don't go away. We've got some great action coming to you from IWA Television.